and welcome to One Heart Heroes. This is Wade. And this is Cody. What the fuck were you talking about? People puking? Yeah, there was a game where like if you spun around a lot, your character would throw up. I have no idea. I can't remember. That or they get really dizzy and like, ooh, act sick. I don't remember. Okay, so we're starting out this episode being summoned to a cooperative place. Everybody, <clears throat> don't panic. We're not doing multiplayer. We're actually doing a quest in the game. We're helping Cirrus of the Sunless Realms. Oh, As man. she, like, enchants her Spear of Doom? Where? Oh, there he is. Get out of here. Oh, helping her take down a Dark Spirit. Yep. Oh, whoa! Who's got some mad damage going on there with a shoulder bash. Alright, fuck this dude. Bam. That did nothing. Bam. That did a little bit of something. No, you're right. That that was that wasn't bad. I say it's definitely not bad for poking. Whoa! Ooh, except for when he comes at you He's like that. Roaring. Oh boy. Ooh, that's that was that no heal oh. missed, wasn't it? Yeah, that was a Lloyd's talisman. Okay. I'm serious, fucking do something. She's trying to poke him. Wait, do something, Jesus. Done. <laughs> I'm doing things. If that healed me, it would be better. Mm -hmm. Don't don't let him heal, woman. Who the hell is this guy? Just a Dark Phantom. He's a mean Dark Phantom. So, she's a part of the, the blade. There you go, you got her now. Uh, a, a part of the, um... Damn, I don't remember what they're called. Anyways, Thank they... You for your kind assistance. The White Moon Blades or whatever? Moon dark Moon journey. Blades. Bam. So, um... Defeated your one return to your thing. So, she's at war with those um, who invade people's um, realms. Oh yeah, yeah. They're they're those two factions are at war. <clears throat> That's why it was so like sketchy for me to go to her and offer her pale tongues, because technically that's the people that she's at war with. Why is it sketchy? Because I'm making an offering to someone she's at war with, so like that could potentially fuck up my oh, quest. Oh, 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 gotcha. Yeah, that's why I was so very, very. <clears throat> Um, like reluctant. I guess she doesn't care if you're two faced. Um, I actually haven't paid homage to the other um goddess, quote unquote. Uh, so you're just waiting. Is what is she technically a goddess? I don't know. There's been some speculation. I don't think so. She definitely wasn't badass enough to be a goddess. I mean, you saw she was. Oh getting no, her ass you're talking about C C Sarah's not no. The I was talking about the person who has the worm wrapped around her in the cathedral. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. She's the white moon person or white the dark blade person? No, she is the invader people. And the people that are with you are as the... Dark moon blades. Dragon chick? Yes. Girl with yes. tail? Yes. We have technically not met don't, her yet. I don't give me that look. Okay. So, everyone, as you know, Henri <laughs> is over here usually. Since we cut like so late and that was our last episode for that session... Well, like, I had to make it here real quick. That way we didn't lose all of our progress. I met up with Henri, and then turns out that one of these statues over here was a dude that was trying to assassinate her. So I killed him. A dude dressed as a dude? A dude dressed as a dude acting to be another dude. That was actually a statue. Yeah. <laughs> and I killed him. And he gave me a, um, a spell or a miracle. It's called Chameleon. Which turns you... Into a random item in the area. Yeah. <clears throat> that actually, and doing that, makes you fail the Lord of Hollows quest. So we are actually no longer able to be Lord of Hollows. Oh, yeah? Yep. All right. So what are we gaming for, Wade? What ending might we be getting? Uh, not the betrayal, but, like, I think we're going to kill the Firekeeper. That way she can't kindle the flame. Hang on. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you can smother the flame. Yep. Fuck. You can kindle the flame. And you can become the Lord of Shadows. Yeah. So why not become the Lord of... Like, why... Is, that, the, is it this guy again? 
Yeah. Ho! Ho! You got some lightning. Yo. Jesus Christ, he's annoying. Um, let me think here. So, I guess my confusion is coming from, um, like, what are you going to do then? I'm going to smother the flame, basically. Oh, so you're going to do what Thallion did? No. That's the betrayal. Oh, where the firekeeper smothers it instead? Yeah, where she's in on it. I'm just going to kill the firekeeper. I'm going to kill the, kill the firekeeper. Okay. Hmm. So what's the difference in those? Um, off the edge. Whoop. Uh -huh. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, the difference would be, I don't know. I haven't beat it. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Actually, I have two characters that are very close to beating the game. I have not beat it with either of them. I know one of them will be... Um, one of them will be the Lord of Hollows ending, which I don't know that one either. Well, we can only assume you become the Lord of Hollows. There's something about to pop up behind you. I know it. Actually, wait. What am I doing? I don't need to fight these dogs for any reason. See something behind you. It's a dog. It's a dog. With a human skull? That's yeah. That's disturbing. That's weird. Just like everything else in this God-blessed game. Right. Or God-forsaken game, whatever you want to call it. Guys, I may or may not have done some leveling. So, like, I have some awesome... Whatever gave it away. I have some awesome spells. <laughs> uh, awesome miracles. Don't let me... Don't let me get that shit twisted. So, Wade, why are you attacking people whose heads are made of dry ice? That's a lot of dry ice. That's a very... Why do I attack anybody in this game? What got you so interested in, like, me attacking people? What do you mean? Like, I don't know why I'm attacking them. They're attacking me. <laughs> well, like, why do they look like dry ice? I don't know. Why are they why are they dust bunnies? Why are they man-sized dust bunnies? No clue. Well, help me out here. Well, you're supposed to be the lore person, way. What happened to them? Uh, something here in the Irithyll Valley. Turn them into dust bunnies? Yeah. Giant totes. Terrifying dust bunnies. Can I? Uh, or noob from um Ooh, excuse me. Or noob from Mortal Kombat. Smoke. Um, noob has the shadow stuff. Noob has the shadow stuff, but smoke literally looks like smoke. He doesn't look like smoke. He just has a smoke attack. No, he like constantly smokes. Well, that's not healthy, and we shouldn't support that, Wade. <laughs> <laughs> Those are fucking terrifying. Yeah, they should be your worst nightmare seeing as you're terrified of spiders. I hate spiders. Dung pies for <sighs> everyone. Because I'm into pooper. God, I hate spiders. Right? And these things are like Big creepy spider cricket Human woman spiders. people things. Spider crickets are cool. They're not actually spiders. They look terrifying. Yeah, they're just really, really big crickets that, like, look like spiders. That's fine. They look close enough to die. <laughs> God. Nuke it from space. That's the only way. That's what I'm saying, man. So, okay, here's the <coughs> thing that I learned um, while playing. You notice how... I, all right, so I sent Grey Rat out for the Irithyll dungeon. You notice yeah. how there's no, like, remains over there? Yeah. If you don't come here and do this little part first, you'll find his remains over there because he got killed by these things. Really? Yeah, man. <clears throat> Jesus. And I feel really bad for him when it happens because that's a terrible way to go. Grey Rat's my buddy. Why are you so close to Grey Rat? Because, man, he sells me shit. And, like, he lost his love and everything. Like, he's my buddy. I will not send him to Lothric castle like it's a death sentence every time why are you sending him around anyways like what does he do he gets more um items oh, yeah. to sell you yeah it's like now he should be able to sell me um <sighs> i don't remember exactly <coughs> excuse me but he'll be able to sell me more stuff so there's just no way he can make it out of lothric no he that will, sucks he will die so i guess if you get just get too greedy Oh, it's Onion Knight. Yeah. Pass straight the fuck out. Fucking wake up, fatso. 
Wake up. Uh, oh, oh, oh. There you go. Oh, excuse me. <coughs> I must have dozed off. Yeah, yeah, fat yeah, ass. It's rather warm in here. Yeah. Well, and that uh, nice heated honey in his long. suit. It's good to see you. Oh, I seem to have missed my chance, so... I, Siegfried of Katarina, offer my deepest gratitude. What did you miss You're your welcome. chance for? And a little surprise to go with it. Ooh. It's all yours. What'd you give me? Emit force. I wonder what that does. Sounds like an arcane spell. I it's know. a miracle, I think. Oh, Will you join me I for think? dinner? I make a fine Esther soup. Oh, I've got some stew right now. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. <clears throat> from time to time. And finally, upon this rendezvous, let us make a toast. What if he's going to attack you once you realize he took, oh. you took his I got more, nums? I got more Sigbro. Sigbro? What the fuck is Sigbro? Booze. My sword. It's booze Hello. that, Swan like, duties. um, it's booze that, like, Long undead people get to, uh, shine. enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> yep. So, what? His thing is filled with fermented honey. Then. Have you heard? Have, what Somewhere, I? hidden right here in Irithil, is a deep dungeon. Okay. And even below that, the profane capital, capital home of Yorm, the reclusive giant lord. Yeah. That reminds me, I have a grave promise to keep. What really? grave promise is that? Oh, sorry. I'm afraid I've cast a cloud over things. Well, I'm going to have myself a, tiny a little dude in a big ass metal suit. The only thing to do, Here's really, to after a nice toast. <laughs> it's cropped or something. Huh. Close cropped. <laughs> Back to sleep. Pass straight the fuck out again. Okay. Make sure you go through all. Decided to try and kill his ass. Make sure you go through all of that dialogue. If you do not. <laughs> He will not save your little buddy. Gray Rat? Yes. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. And that'll be the end of Gray Rat. <clears throat> you are all about saving some Gray Rat. Yeah, man. Like, I try to save as many people as I can. Oh, who's that? Whoa. Is that? Oh, no. It's just a normal person. Okay. Oh, okay. I thought it was like a secret co-op thing that I've never seen before. I'm really excited for Excuse a second. Guys. I'm sorry if I'm coughing and my mind might be sniffling a little bit. I've got a uh, I've got a sinus infection and apparently some bron mild bronchitis, which I've been taking some medicine for for the past like week. Faker. <clears throat> I wish. Bonfire. Sit at said bonfire. But uh, yeah. So like I've been I've been sick as hell and trying to get over it. Shoop, shooba doop, shooba dooba doop. Do yeah. I'm oh, sorry. Yes. No, you're good. Fucking. So, um. That's gotta be it. In our Mario Maker episode. Yeah. We talked about, um. What was it? The. Uh, the shoot. Sex something. Yo! Nope. Sex factor. Yeah. Oh, it's the guys with the swords again, yo. Yeah. Anyways, we talked about sex factor and, uh. While that was like, you know, cool and all, it brings up a fun subject that uh, I want to talk about, Wade. Yeah? Yeah, the fact that the guys at NASA drew a freaking dick pic on Mars with the Mars rover. Like, <laughs> wait, so like NASA made a dick out of rocks or something? Or? No, they, like the Mars rover, it's tracks in the sand, they made it draw a dick. On purpose? Yes. Oh, God, I love NASA. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm like 90% sure it was on purpose. I can't say for sure, but there's a picture on the internet because NASA's open source, if I remember correctly. Yeah, totally. You can, like, we could actually stream <clears throat> NASA shit, like, right now, if we wanted to. Like, I'm pretty, which is hilarious, but I'm pretty sure it was 4chan, of course. So, that's, I'm not completely sure how legitimate it like is. 4chan noticed it, or... They were digging through NASA's pictures, like their ar archive. Why would they do that? Because it's 4chan. Sure. All right. <laughs> I mean, what else, what other reason do they need? Yeah, I guess that's true. And they're, they found this picture. It was freaking the tracks in the sand drawing a penis. <laughs> and everyone's like, well... 
This is what NASA's spending its free time doing programming. Because, I mean, it, it takes sure like, what, 30 minutes or something like that to send a signal to Mars? Uh, depending. I mean, depending on the. Bullshit. Oh, such bullshit. That really sucks. He's got a crossbow. He's got the washing pole. <clears throat> oh, dear. Stab, stab, stab. Ah. Oh, that this is fucked. sucks. I think that's the washing pole. That actually may be a scimitar. That's no scimitar. Jesus Christ. You see that spin? Spin to win, yo. God. You need to you need to heal. Yeah, I do. Wait, I he's tracking you. You're going to die. I need to get off of Later, man. Well. M what? Murakumo. Mm. That was a uh, NPC spirit. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Good to know. Um not a very smart one either. So let's do a little bit of healing. <laughs> but anyways, like they had to program in the specific coordinates and shit. If I remember, like to draw a dick pic on there, and I find that absolutely. Ah, oh, it's a strength. I based. find that absolutely hilarious. Curved sword. Fuck that. I mean, yeah. I don't know. I I doubt the validity validity of it, because <clears> like <throat> to do. You know how many people they have to go through. To like enter any kind of coordinates at NASA. True, but who knows? Maybe someone just got free reign and they're like, doo -doo 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 -doo. minor adjustments fucking are welcome, being made. Welcome, <laughs> welcome to Dark Souls. Fucking doors the game. <laughs> doors, all the doors. Anyways, even if it's not true, Yo. I'm gonna believe it because I find that. Oh. Don't take his rusted coin, yo. Well, you did. Because <laughs> I find that hilarious. Just saying. I mean... So, how much... I'm just saying, Wade, when are we going to go to Mars? Uh, me and you? I mean, no, not me and you. We're never, we're, we're never going to make it. But, like, I swear, was it was Elon Musk or something like that. The, <laughs> we're never going to make it. The, we won't live that long. The uh, the SpaceX guy, yeah, like they're trying to. Uh, they've had some successes recently. <clears throat> they're with their like man-made, their man-made rockets. They're uh, I guess not NASA-made rockets and everything. Yeah, yeah, man. Like they're they're wanting. He's wanting to in his lifetime to have uh, like people starting to colonize Mars. I don't know if it's going to happen though. I don't. I don't know. Um, I would say another 30 or 40 years <coughs> Excuse me. we'll probably be trying to put it together. Um, no. all right. Um, anyways, like, I don't know. I don't, I don't think. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is long. that? Oh, fuck my health. What? You see how much considerably lower it is? Like, keep an eye on my health bar, motherfucker. Okay. That's horse shit. What did she do to you? Looked at me. Well, that's mean. <clears throat> I mean... See my health bar? Oh, God, it reduced. Not just, like, it didn't go down, just it did, like... It literally reduced. Yeah. The fuck? Yeah, that's horse shit. This, that is mean. This is the worst area in this game. Wow, look yep. at that shit. Yep, yep. Huh. <laughs> that's bullshit. I hate those people. So then those guys can prove like a major threat whenever like you can only take two hits. Mm hmm Huh. Yeah, man. <clears throat> okay, so anyways, you were saying like within like 30 years you think that maybe... Oh, yeah, totally. I think we'll be able to make it to Mars. Honestly. Hmm. I have faith in NASA. Yeah? Yeah. Enough people want to go to space that... Like, it'll happen. <clears throat> I don't know what we'll do when we get there. It's the final frontier, man. Like. We'll start terraforming Mars and then uh, go from there. Yeah. In about 500 years, we'll be able to uh, live on Mars. Oh, wait. Oh, oh this is going to suck. Ha <laughs> ha, she can't see you. Yo. Oh, God, she can see you. Shit. Such oh, that bitch. sucks so bad. No, good thing, bad do thing. You about lose, do you do you does that health stay lost? Like when it recovers, the one that your bar recovers. I could have swore I just heard somebody. <clears throat> I did too. Good job. What was that? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Yo. 
Oh, look, it's the... It's the leg cages again. Who knew that they would make a return? Wasn't that a product? Um, Didn't we have a product with them, or am I thinking crazy? No, no, no. That was that was later. Oh yeah. Yeah. Just just making sure. I mean, who <laughs> who would want that product? Well, it's like it's the Dark Souls equivalent of a Roomba. <laughs> I say it scuttles around and has like all the arms and legs and it dusts everything. Well, tell me about it, Bill. <laughs> 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 what, what 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 John? Yeah, John. Well, John. <laughs> Our handy dandy Roomba 5000. <laughs> I we're working on a better name so we don't get sued. It's okay. We're just hanging on to the uh, to the amount of legs. We're correct. Ex yes, exactly. The Roomba 5000. It slices, it dices, and it cleans up after you. See? Oh, oh God! What? It sprouted! It sprouted! Oh no 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 no! Send the Roomba no, no, 5000 no, no. in to clean up. No 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 no. Why does this always happen whenever you're doing your pitches? I don't know. I, know. I just can't seem to sell anything. You need to fucking work on that, Bill. It's my, me? Me? <laughs> this is my fault? Yeah, it's you, Bill. It's all you. Anyways, our Roomba 5000 can do anything you can do, but five times faster. Why? Because it has five times the amount of people crammed into it. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Exactly. Uh, oh God. So, Bill. Yes. How exactly does the Roomba Five Thousand work? Well, we get people and we starve them until we can cram five of them into a cage, at least five. If you want more people, you can pay more money, <laughs> and it's more effect. It's more effective because there's more limbs sticking out. But, like, you can have one of them, like, cooking for you while the other one's, like, you know, cleaning the floors. Or can, whatever. Can we be guaranteed of the quality of this work? Why, yes. All you have to do is offer to let them free if they serve you. <laughs> and then just never do it. Oh. They'll um, stay motivated for weeks, at least. At least? Mm-hmm. After that, you need to replace the people in it. It's like batteries. <laughs> it, 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 are the people at least cheap? Why, yes, they are. <laughs> it seems like that would get expensive. No, 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 no. It's, it, you know what? I can't go on with this joke. No? Patent pending? No, I was about to make a, uh, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> Cody, people don't appreciate slavery jokes. It involved Donald Trump. Oh, God. So, oh God, I can only imagine. Yeah, I'm just gonna let everyone's imagination play out. I'm not. I couldn't. I couldn't go on with that We're one. We're not that terrible of human beings. Exactly. Um, I think I killed the other thing over here. <clears throat> excuse me. But yeah. So the next subject, I'm just gonna. Uh, nope. Just gonna walk. Just gonna walk no, away nope, from that. Nope. 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 No. 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 Say, let everyone just make up their minds on how horrible of a joke that was. So, 55-gallon barrel of lube weighed. Oh, I mean, it looks like we didn't go far from it. <laughs> <laughs> what? Um, I mean, you might need a 55-gallon barrel of lube to fit all the people in the cage. <laughs> Damn, but, uh... You know, you, you know that, like... Alright, so, I'm assuming that you're talking about the one that the guys who own Cards Against Humanity sent to, uh... The Yal Qaeda? Yeah. The fuck is that? The nope. Just nope. Uh, it's like Gollum, but whoop. uglier. I thought you could talk to it for a second. Nope. Was it not going to attack? Only I had a ring. No. Didn't look like it. What was it? No. Well, but. Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So anyways, this uh, group of rednecks, like, they took over some kind of... Uh, compound or something. Some, like, some kind of government compound. Like, it was a national forest out, or, like, reserve something or other. Like, anyways, I know the details are sketchy as hell, right? But they took it over and they said, you know, give us back our land, so on and so forth. If you don't give us the rights, we'll not leave. We have weapons. So, you know, they were at a standstill. They, I think they may have uh, taken some people hostage and so on and so forth. Well, <clears throat> so they sent messages to people in there because 
they sent messages on the internet, okay? Their first, their first mistake, because who the hell calls to the internet for help? <laughs> Not even that, though. Okay, who calls to the internet for help whenever you don't have a good cause? Well, they thought they had a good cause. No, 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 no. Turns out that's a one-hit kill if, like, if you get caught by it. Oh, the brand? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's bullshit. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> but anyways, I'm starting to ramble. So, they go on the internet and they say, We are running low on supplies. Please send us food and snacks. They asked for snacks. People, these, you know, hard-hitting rebels asked for snacks. Um, they forgot their Lunchables. Yeah, they already. forgot their it's fucking fuck, Lunchables. It's, it's dire needs. <laughs> they might like say food and snacks and so on and so forth. So the internet got together and they, they done sent what they them, do best. Exactly. They sent them edible dicks. And um, well, at least they were edible. <laughs> they, they, people, they did send them gummy dicks and like bags <laughs> of uh, hard dick candies. So, I mean, at least... And uh, someone sent them, like, a crate of dildos, I Ooh. think. I'm not sure on that one, but... What Wade was saying is the Cards Against Humanity people actually sent a... Uh, the CEO. The CEO? Yeah. yeah sent a 55-gallon barrel of lube to them so they could use, you know, all those dicks they well, were getting. I was about to say, what you forgot is, like, someone sent a huge box of just dildos. That's what I said, a crate of dildos. Oh, okay, I missed the crate of dildos. <laughs> yeah, to, you know, utilize that crate of dildos that they had gotten sent, yeah. so... <clears throat> yeah. Oh, no, no, Jesus, no. Jesus, it's got a don't weapon? Make, don't make me... Don't don't make me lose my lizard. Aw, oh, but... Look, Wade. It's... <laughs> God, God. <laughs> look, John, it's our new Cabbage Patch Kid toy. Oh, God, Bill. What? No. <laughs> Bill, put it back. <laughs> but I just designed this one. Uh, nope. <laughs> okay, fine. I say, but it doesn't... Only sleep now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Anyways. <laughs> no. <laughs> eh, fine. You don't like the Cabbage Patch Kid. That's fine. <laughs> we'll hit something else later on. Things that make you go... <laughs> Um, but yeah, it's a 55 gallon barrel of lube, people. And, um, if you go on Amazon, you can find this, this big ass barrel of lube and it has some of the best reviews. I'm just saying. Yeah. Yeah. Like one guy was, it, it started out sounding legit because he was looking for some kind of semi affordable way to like lube up this massive slip and slide for his son's birthday. <laughs> So he's like, he got the barrel of lube, but, um, like he goes into this long story and then it ends up, you know, <sighs> the kids on the, the kids like got too much speed going on and like they were too frictionless. It worked too well. So like some of them flew through the fence, some of the lube got on the merry-go-round and like it started spinning faster and faster and faster. And then like the kids shot off of that and like the clown ended up exploding or something i don't know it escalated and just kept on going God. it was hilarious though it's good that like he started small and then just slowly worked his way up because that's that's like so many people make the mistake they just go too high too quick right like okay. he 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 was actually pretty seamless in how he kind of uh slowly escalated because i was sitting there I was like okay okay and i didn't i didn't know i'd reach the what the fuck point until i'd already gotten there oh, oh what is that oh it's a giant oh fuck why did you just oh, decide to poke fuck. its elbow oh fuck oh jesus way fuck. huh found a new thing the things you learn <laughs> All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching One Heart Heroes. <laughs> um, <laughs> civilians, if you want to be heroes, so close. To all you have to do is click the watermark in the bottom right-hand corner, or the big heart on the end slate. Tweet at us, One Heart Heroes, with the number one. Spelling is on the end slate. Um, leave a comment, guys. What do you think about our new Cabbage Patch Kid toy? Oh, excuse me, guys. Sorry. Um, it's gross. <laughs> That was what, that's what Wade thinks about it. A yep. nice big belch. Mm. Maybe I should name it our car, our garbage pail kid boys. I don't know. Oh, no, oh, no, no, Wade. no, 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 Wade. no, oh, I'm so sorry. 50 fucking thousand.
Got anything else to say? <sighs> Feel the beat, everyone. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Made it. I knew it. From Jihad something? Jihad? I thought it said J-I-H-A-D. Um, maybe?